All right, everybody, welcome back to Fallout 4 today. I already sold my stuff, as I said I would do last time. Thankfully, didn't forget. I almost started up the recording with, uh, with forgetting, so that would have been pretty shitty, but we're going to get right back into it. I can't, oh yeah, I left the marker there because I want to go there, and then we also have to go there as well. We might as well start with the vault, I guess. I mean, the vault's easier to get to. I've already gotten to the vault. I don't think I found the entrance, though. I found, like, kind of the entrance, but not really the exact entrance, so. We'll go to this vault, see if I can find it. Hopefully I can. And we'll keep making our way towards getting Ada's quest done. I'm sure some people have asked me if I'm going to do the DLC. Um, I know Far Harbor, I'm pretty sure it's called Far Harbor. I know that one's supposed to be pretty good. It's supposed to be a, a pretty beefy uh, add-on. I don't know what the other one was, though. I have no fucking clue. Some automatron DLC, and I have no idea what it does. I have the season pass. I should have, I should have the DLC. I just don't know when I'd get to it because I haven't even beaten or gotten that far in the actual game. So I don't know if I'd really want to do the deal, the DLC at this point. Where the, here we go. I don't know if I'd really want to bust them open, considering I haven't really gotten that far in the game, and since I've never really beaten the game. I mean, I imagine you don't have to wait till the end to, to do it, but I don't know. I'm sure I'll get to it at some point. Got tons of other stuff to do in the meantime, like explore every fucking building we come across. That takes forever. I miss like 70% of the stuff in game anyway. All right, well, hopefully these, uh, hopefully these mobsters haven't respawned. Doesn't seem like it. All right, now we gotta find where the entrance to the stupid vault is. Oh, actually, there are mobsters down here. Never mind. Never mind. Either I didn't clear them all out, or they respawned. I don't know which one. I don't know which one's the right one, but I feel like I feel like I just probably didn't clear these guys out. I feel like there were a lot more before than just like three random guys down here, right? That's what I feel like at any rate. I should probably take all this stuff because I have the capacity. I need to keep selling stuff, get my caps up. Oh, here's the VODs right here. It's right fucking here. Alright, well. That didn't take long. Now to see if we can actually get inside. I mean, we have this thing. We have our Pip-Boy. That should help us out. There's just gonna be ton, tons of trigger men inside. Well, you know, that's what I thought about uh, the one water processing place. No, they're definitely in here. I figured there'd just be a bunch of super mutants inside, but then it ended up being like a ton of minor lurks. So, I mean, you never know what you're gonna get. Alright. I'm just gonna check this room. That's what I wanted to do in the first place, and this guy popped out. I've been, I've been feeling some fallout lately as well. It's kind of a welcome employees. After many months of preliminary construction, we are pleased to welcome staff members of all technical and scientific staff to the newest addition of the vault Tech family, Vault 114. What was going on in this vault? All right, well, it doesn't really tell me. Oh, what is this? Hold on. Be hosting high ranking members of local and state government, local luminaries, and business people and their families. Future members are aware that they will be cohabitating solely with others of Boston's upper class. Okay. Cohabit. I don't know why I can't. Cohabitating. Cohabit. I want to say like habilitating, but I don't know why I want to put an, put an L in there. It's kind of weird, right? I just want to, like, add letters where letters should not be added. Habilimitation. I don't know what is it with me and words. I am becoming illiterate. That's what I think I'm becoming. It's not a good thing to become, really.
I mean, nothing against anyone who's actually illiterate, but... I would much rather stay literate. You know. We need the key. Oh, we need a key. All right. Well, let's go find the key, then. I imagine this leads somewhere. Guess some random guy is going to have the key somewhere. Yeah, I've been feeling like getting into getting into some fallout. So I got a question. Why the hell would anyone build a vault out of a subway station? Dog me, come on. This place is like the opposite of airtight. Because they weren't planning to use it, you moron. We used to pull this kind of con all the time back before the war. Get a bunch of union boys to work some construction job that would go nowhere. Keep everyone on payroll. Kind of sucks that uh, the subtitle is kind of conked out there. Wait. It's whatever. I mean, it doesn't matter if they conked out. These guys are going to be dead. And if Dogmeat would move, come on, Dogmeat. You, I got to parkour over Dogmeat here. Man. Oh, now he now he wants to move after... <laughs> After I've already eliminated the threats in the area, dog meat moves out to make sure it's secure for me, even though I already secured it. Can I, like, crit? There we go. I got a nice sneak attack damage there. Or a nice sneak attack, I should say. Can't hit that guy. Are there, like, explosives everywhere? No, that's not like it. Uh, there's quite a few enemies in here. Dog me. Alright, what here, let me command him. Here, go go fucking attack that guy. Why do I have to tell you to attack him? Just go do it. He won't do it! He won't do it! I told him to do it, he won't do it. Oh shit. Oh, he's attacking this guy. This guy got too close. I don't know what happened to Dog Me. We left him in Sanctuary for a while, and now he's just kind of a wuss. That guy. Now he's just kind of being a wuss. I don't know what he's doing. Look at him. Oh, he finally tried to attack like one. There he goes. Now now that everything's been kind of cleared out a little bit, now he's brave again. Now he's going to be brave. Am I the only one in, who ever had this much trouble with companions in this game? Am I the only one? The only person? I don't even know what I'm looking for. I picked up something... I picked up this. Well, it's not even better. I mean, none of this stuff's really better than what I want. Now I gotta give dog meat stuff again. Hey. Well, at least I can actually trade with him. Now, let's see. Let me get rid they have tons of submachine guns. I gotta give him all my junk too. I don't even have that much junk. I kept the yardstick for some reason. Whatever. I don't even know what was weighing me down. Probably all the submachine guns that they had. Those are probably kind of heavy. I'm getting closer and closer to being able to carry like more and more weight. I just gotta dump some. Well, actually, I think the next time would probably be trying to see if uh, the Lone Wanderer works while having dog meat. Word on the street is that's what happens, but there could also be some liars on the street trying to lead me astray and lie to me. I guess we'll see. Where the fuck is this key at? Can't get in there. I guess we just have to drop down that fucking shaft or the elevator or the air vent, whatever this shit was. Apparently there's really no use to getting just right there. Oh, bobby pins? I need bobby pins. We all know I need bobby pins. I only have like 150 of those things. What am I going to do with that many bobby pins? We've already read this. Did this really dump me back out at the beginning? Am I at the beginning? No, this is... This is kind of, Wait, what? I thought it was going to be like a regular door you go through. It was a loading door. All right. I'm trying to drink some water with this loading time. It's just it's too quick for me. Where are all the enemies at? There's no enemies in there. 
Dog meat's whimpering. I don't know why he's whimpering. He hasn't done anything but carry some stuff for me. How you doing in there, Valentine? Feeling hungry? Want a snack? Keep talking, meathead. It'll give Skinny Malone more time to think about how he's gonna bump you off. Don't give me that crap, Valentine. You know nothing, you got nothing. Really? I saw him writing your name down in that black book of his. Lousy cheating card shark, I think were his exact words. Then he struck the name across three times. Three strikes? In the black book? But I never... Oh, no. I, I, I gotta smooth this over fast. Oh, that guy left. I don't even know if that's who we were supposed to kill. I don't even know if that guy was just... Oh, no, it was an enemy. He ran down... Oh, it's Dino. It's Dino or Dino. I'd imagine Dino. Could be, could be Dino. Maybe he really likes dinosaurs. I don't fucking know. Why am I going to judge him? I wish I had a fucking sweet nickname like Dino or Dino, but no. I get named after a moose. What was name me after a moose? It's better than my old nickname. My old nickname used to be Shamu when I was a kid and I was fat. There have been, uh, there have been a couple different points in my life where I was a little hefty. I will, uh, I will admit that. I don't even know what I should be eating here. Yeah, let me let me eat some garbage food before before I lose track of what I'm trying to say. I always do that. I already talked about this before. It's hard to talk and like think of something completely opposite and do it at the same time. It doesn't really work for me. I mean, maybe maybe I'm just crazy. Maybe maybe I'm just the uh, anomaly. But you know what? Oh, this would be easy. Easy. Oh, there goes his, his head. Like, just stayed in the same spot, and he just did a cartwheel. What was that? We got the overseer door password, some bottle caps. Nothing too great. I think that uh, that Valentine guy. I don't even know if we have the quest for that yet. But I'd already talked about. Let's see. Yeah, it, it is. We do have that quest. Apparently, he's here. It seems like he might be here. It seems like he might be being held captive or prisoner here or something. I don't know what he did to these guys, but they're mad. I had no idea he was here. Yeah, some of my nicknames in life have not been too good. Got it. I've been kind of mean. Shamu was usually used when I was a kid. Call me Shamu. Because I was as big as a whale, apparently. I don't really know if that's, like, the best nickname to give, like, I don't know, like a 12-year-old. But it's probably not very good for self-esteem. I mean, it really didn't work for me too well, but, you know. People got to get their funny jokes across. They gotta be fucking hilarious, right? Now I'm just kind of named after a moose. Kind of. I don't really have a nickname, I guess. I mean, some people, some people call me fucking moose. They call me fucking moose. Sweet. That's what they call me. Not regular moose, fucking moose. Hey, you. I don't know who you are, but we got three minutes before they realize muscles for brains ain't coming back. There's a bobblehead in there. There is a bobblehead in there. Yeah, now we gotta free this guy. I, I've i never seen this guy before. I guess you're supposed to go to his uh, take number. Number's 998. Wait until your number is called. Oh, fuck the overseer. Fuck him. I guess you're supposed to probably walk in his little building and then find out he's not there and then go find him, but it appears I kind of skipped that. <laughs> Oh, oh, he's he's like a synth. What the hell? He's a fucking synth. Speech bobblehead. I actually need that. All vendors permanently have a hundred more caps for bartering. That's actually pretty good. And we got some interviews here. Can I even talk to him? Ah, uh -huh, my knight in shining armor. Question is, why does he come all this way and risk life and limb? An old private eye. A terrifying.